Hey everyone, welcome back to The Rocketeer. I get a lot of questions on this channel about recovery. So today I talked to an expert, Buddy from Rocketman Parachutes, and he's going to show us some of the products that they sell and talk about this unique deployment bag that has a pilot chute on it. This pilot chute helps pull the parachute away from the airframe and protects it from black powder burns. All right, let's take a look. Hello, my name is Buddy Michelson with Rocketman Parachutes and uh, we have a lot of new designs that we've been working on. We have our uh, high performance parachutes, our ultralight uh, material, which is a brand new 0.66 ounce ripstop. Uh, we recently got the Spectra lines and uh, the Spectra material, each line's right at 220 pounds a piece. So we've been making a lot of cool shoots with that, like our Proud American shoots. Every single star is uh, all hand sewn. Uh, we also came out with this really cool streamer design. And what's nice is we manufacture these streamers in 16 feet, 32 feet, and 60, but then also over 300 foot in wider patterns. And it's a built-in Kevlar protector, it rolls right up, and you just hook onto this grommet here, and it protects the end. So we make all kinds of custom colors, custom sizes, and dozens of different parachutes. And then we also have uh, deployment bags like the Kevlar uh, built-in pilot chute. We're always coming up with new designs. And Anyways, you can check us out on the hyphen rocketman.com. So this is our four inch bag for our six foot parachutes or six foot parabolic chutes with our uh, built in pilot chute. And this is all Kevlar Nomex bag with pure Kevlar line and pure Kevlar thread. And so we're gonna take a six foot chute that you just got. Uh, we're gonna open up here on twist the lines. And then we're gonna pull to the top. All of our chutes have a top loop at the, at the very top. And so what you do is you take the include lanyard you open up the top loop and you don't need any hardware or anything, it just adds weight and it just kind of, you don't need it. And so you just do a, a simple slip knot there, tie it, and then you take our deployment bag, you go on the inside out, there's also a loop on the inside of these. You go through here, you go through here, and then you're gonna pass the chute just through this loop quick. So you pull it right through. like that and just avoids any kind of hardware or anything. Pull that tight, flip this back inside out. And then now we just pack it. So there's a lot of ways to pack these chutes correctly. Most times you just kind of stuff them in and it's fine. Or you can S it back and forth. So you just stuff the parachute in. And then you just take the lines, making sure they're all equal, and then you just S the lines back and forth nicely, making sure they're not tangled. And then you can do a section like that. They're all nice and orderly. Go like that. And then down the slit is where you would connect your stuff. And then if there's any extra space, you can also put uh, your, your uh, shock cord in there as well and protect it. And then you put this in, and then you can just slide this right into your rocket, and it will go in. Just, and then once it's done, and it would just come out, just like that. And now your chute's open. So easy. And then this just hangs at the top uh, in, in a way. It just hangs at the top of the parachute, doesn't interfere. And uh, it's super nice because you won't lose it or anything. So that's how you protect your chute with our bags. Thanks.